People are going to be celebrating with the cookouts, the pool parties, and even going to the beach. And out in Volusia County, the surf has kicked up. West News Claire Metz reports all eyes are on the water right now, all due to those tight rip currents. We have about 67 employees that are working today. Beach safety is opening as many lifeguard towers as possible through Monday as locals and visitors celebrate the unofficial end of the summer season. There are also officers who are rescuers patrolling in trucks. With the surf up a bit and choppy, the red flag is flying to warn of rip currents. The rip currents were pulling a little bit like late morning. Uh, we had a few rescues go off. I don't have an exact count yet, but uh, the guards were in the water a few times. Midday high tides have led to some beach approaches closing temporarily, but most folks get down here early and set up for a full day. Look okay, at it's beautiful. Everybody out here having a good time, enjoying themselves, being with family. What else can you do? We're enjoying the weather with the family. Yeah. family. Got all the kids, extended family here. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Soft sand has been an issue for some drivers this holiday weekend. Matter of fact, all summer long, with this kind of drifting down from Georgia and North Florida, replacing the hard pack sand we typically see. Some areas are four-wheel drive only, so be careful where you park. A 10 mile an hour speed limit on the beach is strictly enforced as people, particularly children, oblivious, dash back and forth. One thing that has not been a problem, Mother Nature. For the most part, skies have been clear along the coast.